I know he's in control of my life. How about you? I read a church sign, Ricky, just down the road from our house. A Baptist church. You know how churches will have signs with little sayings. And I thought this was one of the best ones I've ever read. Because it said this. It doesn't matter who the president is. Jesus is still king. How about that? That's good. He's still king. And he's the Lord of our life. And I say to you this morning and now this afternoon, if there was a time in this world's history when we need to reach out with an arm of faith, grab a hold of the big hand of God and hold on with everything that we have. It's today. It's today. So God is in control. Don't fear. He has it all under control. But there are some needs represented. Some of you are concerned. I'm concerned. A little bit worried at times. sick, not feeling so hot. And there may be someone here who would like to say yes to Jesus today. We never know who's here. How many with me would raise a hand to heaven? I want to have a little special prayer with you here before we go. How many would say, Brother Roy, when you have this prayer, pray for me here today. I have a need. Raise your hands. I have put you all over. All over. Would you stand? I want us to do something that we normally do. Those of you who know me know I'm a little old-fashioned. And I still believe in old-fashioned altar calls. And I'm going to ask you to come forward today. If you raised your hand, I believe we can do that and still uh, what's the big phrase today social distance but I'm going to ask you to come I'm going to sing this chorus one more time there's room at the cross for you and if you raised your hand I'm going to ask you to just come and stand you can kneel if you want but I'm going to ask you to come and would you allow me to have a prayer around the altar with you could we do that today come as we sing it together again, there's room at the cross. There's room at the cross. Come on, neighbors. For you.
every need be met. Some are hurting. Some are discouraged. Some are wondering what the future holds. Some are disappointed. But we know that you hold the future in your hands. You're God. And beside thee there is no other God. So Lord, I pray for those who may be hurting today. Some are sick. Some have come forward standing in the place of a loved one they've been praying for. Some may have come forward and raised a hand as an act of rededication. And there may be someone here today we never know who is saying at this very moment, Lord, come into my heart. Forgive me. Save me. sin is under the blood, separated from me as far as the east is from the west. Lord, grant as I pray, help them to leave here with that blessed assurance. So thank you for hearing our little prayer here. Thank you for these who have come forward. Meet our needs. Lord, as you look down upon us, would you please reach 